Hey everybody, David and David from payitforward.com and upphone.com. And in this video, we're gonna tell you about the best cell phones under $500 in 2020. Why $500? Well, you know, when you get lower in the price range, uh, there's a lot of really mediocre Androids you can buy, but no really good top of the line brands. Mm -hmm. So in this video, we found some phones that are a little bit older, but they're from the best brands out there. Mm -hmm. Another thing we wanna to mention too, is that if you go to eBay or Amazon, you can find some great deals on newer phones. Just uh, be careful, double check the quality of the phones because sometimes people will try to sell you a cheap iPhone 11 Pro for $300 on eBay and watch out. The screen is shattered and all or the buttons are broken. Yeah, yeah it's totally, you gotta be careful it's not stolen with iPhones. Exactly what David said. This is sort of the price range you have to go to to yep. get a quality phone outright. Yep. And yes, you can put down less money up front, but this video is about, I wanna buy a phone because I do not wanna have that high monthly payment. Mm -hmm that a lot of people do. And if you don't have a phone payment, it's like not having a car payment. That's great. Yeah, it's great. So the first phone we're gonna recommend is the iPhone 8. Let me run through some quick specs for you. 4.7 inch display, 12 megapixel camera, comes in three storage variants, 64, 128, and 256, up to 14 hour battery life talk time. Mm -hmm. Solid iPhone, you used to have the 8. I did not ever have the 8, but I used to have the 7. Okay. And then I got the iPhone 10, which yeah. came out the same time as the 8. Yeah. Eight solid phone, a little bit older, but it's gonna have iOS updates for at least a few more years. So yeah. you'll be able to run the latest version of the iPhone software for years to come. Yeah. It, it's the last phone that didn't have the full screen. Mm -hmm. So if you don't like a notch, yeah, this is the phone to get. Also has the home button. People yep. love the home button. Uh-huh, exactly. Yep, available on a bunch of good carriers. Uh, probably don't have the switch to get this phone. Solid phone, great option. Our next phone is the Samsung Galaxy S8, kind of like the iPhone 8, but for Samsung Galaxy. Mm -hmm. Great phone, great Android phone. My buddy Mitch, he's got an S8. Really? Mm -hmm. Very he fun. loves it. Yeah, It's a good Android phone. Top the line model yep. a couple years ago. Yep, some specs for you, 5.8 inch display, 12 megapixel camera, better battery life, 24 hour talk time. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. It's great talk time. Yep. And this is one where I would just like to say, to check out eBay because mm -hmm. we picked up a Galaxy S10 refurbished, not new, but cost less than 500 bucks. There you go. 64 And it, it's a pretty solid phone, it's a good shape. Right, yep. you're not gonna get it in brand new condition for that price, but it might be worth going refurbished. Yep. Third phone we're gonna recommend is the Google Pixel 3a. We've actually, you know, if we were Android guys, we've mm -hmm. always said this is the phone we get the 3a or the 3a XL. 3a is a little bit cheaper, it'll get you underneath that $500 price range. Really solid phone. Yeah, it's just a great phone. Yep. The Google Pixel 4 is much more expensive mm -hmm. for not a lot more. Yeah. The 3A, the only drawback that we see sometimes is that it's 64 gigabytes of storage, but Google has great cloud storage features like Google Photos that let you store your photos on the cloud and not on the phone, so your phone doesn't need as much on-device storage yep. to be a great phone. Yeah, some quick specs for this phone. 5.6 inch display, 12.2 megapixel camera, and a 32 hour battery talk time, even better than the S8. You get at least through a full day. Yeah, mm -hmm. really solid phone. Those are our top phones under $500 in 2020. Thank you guys for watching this video. Give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Leave us a comment down below with any other questions. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more great videos about cell phones.